At the University of Buffalo, they're blowing up big batches of homemade lava. Why? Because science. When a volcano is erupting, it can send huge chunks of molten lava into the air. Scientists at the University of Buffalo decided to take a look at how these lava bombs are formed and ejected from the volcano with enough force to send them hurtling across the sky. They did this by recreating the conditions with molten rock and water. In a series of 12 experiments, the scientists use a furnace to melt volcanic rocks known as basalt, brewing up 10-gallon batches that were then poured into steel boxes. Then, the researchers injected streams of water into the molten mix, varying the speed of the streams and the depth of the lava to see what happened. Spoiler alert, it exploded. The researchers found that the biggest explosions occurred when the water was injected quickly. The explosions were also more intense when more lava accumulated in the containers before water was added. The findings, published in the Journal of Geophysical Research, Solid Earth, are considered preliminary. Experts say more research is needed to get a better grasp of the physics involved, so that scientists can eventually develop ways to forecast lava bombs and keep people out of harm's way. Hey, NBC News viewers, thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. Subscribe by clicking on that button down here and click on any of the videos over here to watch the latest interviews, show highlights, and digital exclusives. Thanks for watching.